Do, so. And then we have so T, which is what interval? So. Uh, this summer camp is a great opportunity for children and youth to learn about the church's teaching on sacred music. And it's making it come alive for them, um, whether they're eight years old, 16 year old, years old, um, or for the adults uh, attending, you know, how old their grandparents. So. <laughs> chant, you know, is is this unspoken understanding, even if you don't fully understand the Latin, there is something that just speaks to the depth of the human soul and the and, uh, in uh, connecting uh, this intangible realm uh, between heaven and earth, and it just enhances the entire experience of, of the Mass. The feeling that you get when you're singing in a choir up in a choir loft or like in a sanctuary um, and you're all reading the same song and you're all going together and then there's this one uh, line that you're all perfectly harmonized and it, the sound just vibrates through the church. It's really wonderful feeling to have when that's what you're trying to do is praise God through the music. I like it because it's much easier to like look at and be like oh so you need to like sing lower here and higher like as you see the notes up and down. I like sing I like um, the Latin chant. I actually take Latin. Taking Latin is not fun. Singing Latin is fun. There's something about the sung expression that takes the words that we that we emit to the next level. There's a physiological response to collective singing that affects us how we feel in the moment. We're doing something that's not just personal, it's interpersonal. It's all of us doing something together. It's bigger than one voice. It's us praying together. Okay.